When you left for Birmingham, you said that you wanted to win your landing back. I mean, she was the one that got away. Huh. And what do you all do understand? You're right, I don't understand. Because right now, she's over there on Denise's sofa, and you're here giving it your best George Formby cleaning windows. Do me a favour. Thank you for putting me up. I'll be able to be here, so. Oh, don't be like that. You're more or less retired now. Why don't you just stick around a little bit longer? No disrespect, Denise. But there is nothing to stick around for. Oh, come on. I'm going to treat you to breakfast, yeah? So how was she last night? Really sad. She made us watch this black and white movie. She said it was both your favourite. No, Voyager. <laughs> and that Anton guy was called her like 20 times. Don't know why, when he was the one who chucked her out. Still come much. Yeah, I'm sorry I didn't get to say hello to you, Landy. Shame she's not sticking around. Yeah, isn't it? Yeah, crying shame. Especially after what she told me to take breakfast. OK, I mean, she's told me in confidence, so don't tell her I said, but... But that Anton isn't all he was cracked out to be. Granted, he threw her out after he found out about the two of you, but it seems he was a bit manipulative, insecure. Basically, he didn't treat her right. We I knew Landy was going through all that and she didn't tell me anything at all. You see? You do still care for her. Of course I care for her. Then tell her, Patrick, before it's too late. It is too late. She's on the tube. Anton's taken her back. No, Patrick. You said it yourself yesterday, not to let love go. You have to be brave, man. Yeah. Well, come on, Derek. Now, that's what I'm talking Bye. about. Easy, Patrick, you ain't lived with Chris, Dave. Hey, Dez, you'll stop her at the station. <laughs> this is instant gold. <laughs>